What's going on, Capricorn? My name is Gabrielle De La Garza, aka the New York Doctress, and tonight we're going to be doing your LN reading, which is your late night clear audience tarot reading. All right, go ahead, click that subscribe button, click the like button because it really helps me out with the algorithm, um, as well as commenting down below. And if you would like to donate to the channel, the link is in the description box below, as well as go follow me on Instagram at the New York Doctress if you want to see a whole other side of me. So okay although i feel it's weird because so i just want to say the ambiance is very nice okay so i feel like you have like uh i don't know i feel like you're, you're really comfortable in your house you have your comfortable blanket you have the candles it could be raining snowing okay you could have gone away on vacation somewhere or you could be taking this time off all right um i wanted to i was in the pre-shuffle and i was gonna like put it all away but i feel like there's something before you put it away that like you want to look at or double check or see what's going on with something okay capricorn but this story is obviously only going to apply to some of you all right take what resonates leave what doesn't hopefully it doesn't apply to too many of you when, <laughs> when you hear what i got so so okay so someone could be coming to tell you this information about what's going on this could be with you with family members with someone who's close to you best friends all right um but what i'm seeing here is um oh, it's funny because your energy isn't really here so i'm wondering if um you have air in your chart, okay, or water. So, because this could really depict, like, what side you're on, okay? So, I don't know why that's relevant, but, like, I feel like you have to pick sides with something, Capricorn. Try to see if you have to pick sides, though, or someone wants you to pick sides. And I'm getting maybe you don't have to, or, like, maybe deep down you know what side you would pick, but, like, I wouldn't voice this, okay? I feel like something about this would be better for you to just stay neutral, um, but I see a man, so I see a couple, all right, it looks like a water sign and an air sign or someone who has this energy. I feel like the male is giving a lot of money or isn't telling his wife, okay, I don't know where you apply in the situation, Capricorn, so I'm just going to tell it and then you pick your place if this is like resonating. But this male here, okay, is giving a lot of money to this other female, this other female who is not his wife, okay, not his girlfriend, nothing. And the funny or the twisted part about this whole thing is she's actually using it with her relationship with her, either her husband or her boyfriend, okay? So it's weird, like, I almost feel like you're the female over on this equation. Like, maybe you don't have any kids. This is just your boyfriend or husband or whatever. Like, I almost feel like maybe you're... Someone's taking out of your pocket, okay? I am, I'm almost getting, and I don't like this, okay? And if this isn't, like, literally money, it's energy. Like, I feel like your person could be giving someone else a lot of the energy that, like, really you deserve or you earned, okay? And then using that energy to go give it to her man. Like, something about this is just, like, not okay. And I feel like it's more fucked up on the other side of the equation. So I would just, like, uh... Like, I think you might have turned your back on this water sign. Okay, this King of Cups. Like, let him go pay for all her shit. Like, maybe someone doesn't even, like, buy you things. Like, buy you nice things. But meanwhile, he's out here, like, buying her a ton of stuff. And she's already got a man to buy this for her. So, she's the one making out. Like, or this could be you. <laughs> maybe you're the female in the equation. Maybe you have the water in your chart. And so, like, you're actually getting, like all this stuff. I don't know. But I feel like the one who's not really receiving anything, um... I feel like this person's going to exploit or, or like, figure out what's going on, okay? Or maybe you know about this. Let's see what's going on, Capricorn. All right, these messages are a little bit more focused. Just wanted to throw that out there because I am doing the readings more frequently. So this could resonate anywhere between the next... I was getting two days to two weeks, okay? Going on with Capricorn. Okay, the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so I was getting in your pre-shuffle something about residuals, all right? So I actually had to look up what this meant because I really wasn't sure. At first, I was getting, like, residuals, like, something of, like, bone, your DNA. So, like, this was getting pretty deep, Capricorn, but I was hearing, like, there's something, like, within your blood, your bone, your DNA, like, wherever you're, you're from, okay? Like, there's, like, uh... 
it's not as the superpower isn't the word that I'm looking for, but that's like an equivalent of something. Okay. So I feel like you're like, so I was getting, all right. So now it's coming back to me. So I'm getting like medieval times. Okay. Or like back in that like era of some sort. Okay. I, I feel like I was getting like residuals, like maybe you're here to like make up for something that happened in the past okay or like from your ancestry but i feel like this is to build on to grow on like this is something like you're meant to have in this lifetime because of things that you took care of back in those times back in your past lives all right you're meant to have something now in this lifetime yeah justice and the hierophant like i feel like something is committed to you just as you're committed to it you're committed to source source is committed to you okay I feel like this offer is coming. I feel like this is something you've been waiting on. All right. This could, I'm just getting residuals. This could be slow. I was also hearing too, it's equivalent to like royalties. Okay. Or like extra stuff that's left over. Now this could be something to do with a house or loan payment payment as well. So like maybe all you have to do is like pay the residuals on something or you're getting paid these residuals. You're getting paid these royalties. You're getting, you're getting the money out of this. It was slowly but surely going to come and it finally did. It happened. Okay someone could have also passed away and maybe you guys were like arguing over who's getting what who's getting the house who's getting um you know whatever it was that this person left for you guys on their will all right i feel like this is not what this person wanted all right maybe something wasn't just like clear or this could have been something that um was unexpected okay and now you know maybe this person wasn't expecting this and and there was no will or something all right i'm also hearing that i'm also hearing the name william right um all right, let's move on. What is this Knight of Pentacles for Capricorn? Yeah, so this could come to you in about six months or six weeks where you receive this payment, this money, okay, um, this check, this, this residuals check or something, all right? Or maybe you just got this brand new car, all right? You're showing it off. You're flaunting it. It could be black with like red leather interior. I'm hearing this is really nice. This is really nice, Capricorn. Okay. Could be a Mustang. All right. Look, and there's the, wow, you have the Knight of Cups, the Knight of Pentacles, the Knight of Swords. So I feel like everyone's showing up for you, Capricorn. All right. If this isn't like in the actual physical world and the physical realm, I'm hearing this is in the spiritual world. People are showing up for you left and right. They're here to help you out. They're here to support you. Maybe you finally took this like leap of faith with something. Maybe you finally decided like, okay, I I'm going to actually like go ahead and forge forward with something that maybe you've never even done before. All right. I'm getting, this is something huge and you have tons and tons of support, things backing you, people waiting for you. Like I'm almost getting people waiting for you on the sideline, like with water or like when you go into the pits, like during the races, like where they like make sure everything's good, you know, check your tires, whatever, whatever. Like I, I get that you have this, this like team of support or like helping you at all times. And this could be in like real life too. Like you're able to sleep at night because these people help you with your problems. They talk you through these things. Okay. Like this could be parents or if it's not your parents, it's like, you know, maybe your boss or yeah. Or fa other family members, whatever it is, it's, it's friends. Like you have a really good support system. Okay, so you could be, I, I feel like you are, you have pick of the litter, okay? You you have first dibs on something. I mean, I feel like you're not even sure what to pick, all right? I feel like you have enough money to buy just about whatever you want. And this is, if this isn't the case, okay, this is where you're headed. This is what you're going. This may take a couple of years, all right? Maybe this takes like up to seven years to like finally achieve something but like you have to understand if you're 22 watching this that's only 28 if you're 28 that's what 36 whatever do you know what i'm saying like 35 30 whatever like it's not that it's not that bad it doesn't even matter if you're 56 it's it's still like seven years although it may seem like a lot isn't that bad but it doesn't have to necessarily be that it could be seven months as well all right you're definitely going to see some sort of a change within seven months maybe the way that you purchase things maybe the way you handle your money okay i'm, I'm seeing you being sort of like overwhelmed by support and love all right, maybe this just wasn't what you were ready. To, people could be fighting for you too for something. All right, Capricorn, like it's a very uh, it's a very proud moment. Okay, it almost feels like the crowd is cheering. All right, like people just like really enjoy. 
I feel like seeing you. Okay, so you could do something on stage where people, where you're performing. People love coming to see you. Maybe you just walked away from this recently or walked away from something where like you were on a platform. Yeah, like on a platform of some sort. Okay, maybe you stopped doing this for a while. People miss you. They want you to come back. They don't know where you went. You could be a fitness coach. Okay. Maybe you're not sure where to invest your money as well. I also see that. I see you like, uh, I don't know. Or maybe you're not sure where to move. Like, you're confused, but it's like a good confusion. Like, oh, I don't know what car to get. I don't know what house to buy. I don't know where exactly to live. Like, they're also huge investments, though. It's like, you know, once you drive off the lot, the car's not going to cost as much. And once you buy that house, like, you do have to go through the burden let's just say of like reselling it okay it's not like you can just up and leave and just switch houses whenever you feel like so these are permanent decisions that you're making now those are just examples applied to your life as necessary capricorn um but i do see someone here as well waiting for you so you could be in the process of healing in the process of growing in the process of like establishing yourself your business okay maybe you haven't even run into this person yet but i do see this king of wands here ready to make this offer for when you guys finally do come into alignment all right maybe you're waiting for this Maybe you're both on your throne waiting to come into alignment. All right, Capricorn, hold on one sec. I feel like you have so many gifts too. You don't know what to do with them. Okay. Yeah, the Empress. There you are. Love that. You could have Taurus or Libra in your chart as well, Capricorn. All right. What's going on for Capricorn? the empress again all right so let's leave her out you could start your own clothing line all right uh you could also sing you're also i see a microphone here okay you use your voice for something maybe you do voiceover work or i don't know something about your voice is like very calming very soothing okay you could work with small children as well justice wow and this just came out but it's reversed so you finally make this decision on what it is you want to purchase how you want to invest your money you find the right person to help you do this okay this could even be a woman as well if you're a man watching or if you're a woman this is a woman who's going to be helping you take care of this wow justice with the ten of cups and the world this and the wheel of fortune it works out perfectly perfect for you capricorn go ahead and listen to this person listen to them take their guidance take their support take their help their knowledge like everything their their advice like you are in the safe zone you will not be confused on what it is you have to do okay th this person's here to help you could be a libra or someone um of this nature or they could be working in the court system you could know them they could be um just someone who's part of the government okay in the legal system it's gonna feel like it's you're you're gonna love it no you're gonna love it um this could be someone who you knew from a childhood who now has this like job okay they could be a detective um okay something like something like that Okay, they may offer you some sort of help, guidance. Like I said, make sure that you go ahead and take that because you will be on the right path. Don't worry about it. They're like, they're good people. I'm hearing they're really good people. They're going to help you ward off like all the bad things. Like you're going to know, you're going to know. This person's like, I'm, I'm hearing like a warlock. Okay, so you're if you're a witch, they're a warlock. All right. Yeah, I feel like they give you like... um. I don't know this person like comes out of nowhere i don't even know if this is romantic although it does look like you are sleeping with them so you could be sleeping with them or this is someone you're super attracted to and maybe never sleep with but with the oh yeah okay the ace of swords here so maybe you sleep with them one time you didn't mean to but it happened okay you don't talk about it maybe either or both of you are married or even if you're not you just don't talk about it like all right, this just happened one time and that was it. Yeah, you slept together. I feel like you were sort of felt guilty about this, okay? But it just happened and I feel like this person is really here to help you. This is crazy. This is nuts. This is absolutely insane. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, where did this come from? Yeah, wow. This is amazing. Okay, Capricorn, I'm like in love with this reading. So I do feel like you end up in a really good place. Okay. I don't know where you end up with this person. You could end up even like maybe falling in love with this person. I don't even know. Um, 
but I do see the star card here. I do see something coming like really big out of this. So if this is something you're looking for or looking forward to, well, get ready, buckle up. Um, cause it does look like it's about to happen. It really does. And I feel like you have to, you might have to walk away from this person. Okay. So maybe this person's going to let you go actually now. So maybe you no longer need this teacher, um, after a certain amount of time, or like, this was just like a moment in time with you and this person where like you were together, you talked, they helped you, they got you through these moments. And then like, I feel like somehow they had to go away or you guys, you know, you got split up. It was a tower moment. Okay. Something happened. Someone got some sort of communication and they had to leave. They had to go. And I feel like maybe that was the end of it. That was the end of it. Okay. This could have been a really sad thing, but this was Spirit's way of like, you're ready to like go. Yeah, there it is again. Oh my God. Yeah. So it was like, it's like you're celebrating, but you're also heartbroken. Okay. I feel like something's like bittersweet here, Capricorn. It's a really beautiful thing, but it's also like very heartbreaking. You might miss this person. Okay. But yeah, I feel like you're also celebrating your accomplishments, celebrating where you come and what you're going to be doing next. So I'm like super excited. Okay, we'll see what comes out next, Capricorn. I love you so much. I'll see you on the next. Oh, wow, this, ob this person obviously has some good, good. Okay. Um, all right, anyways, I'll see you on the next one. Make sure you subscribe, like this video, go follow me on Instagram, donate to the channel, and go comment down below. Bye.